Oh, that is cool. So next month, the best in the world will compete in the World Athletics Championships at Hayward Field. And this video right here will be the first thing people see before all of it begins. Devin Haskins talked with the U of O freshman from Lake Oswego about his video that was chosen by event organizers. I love editing high energy and infusing um, edits with momentum. Quinn yeah, Connell has had a love for video editing for the last eight to nine to... years. First dabbling in stop motion and green screen effects, it's become a passion project of his. From the early on, I wanted to make a sports montage that was really exciting, really high octane, and also just really like fun and bold and bright and colorful. Quinn is only 19 and a freshman at the University of Oregon. This past winter term, he enrolled in the motion graphics class and thought it was a perfect fit. One of the assignments in that class, create a video montage for the upcoming World Athletics Championships. Nikki Dunsire is the class's teacher. They wanted big, bold, colorful, um, sort of really bold graphics. They wanted to give this uh, yeah. youthful vigor and, and young energy and attract a youthful audience. And that was kind of the, the main point they circled around a lot through how they wanted to present this. From January through March, over a dozen students competed against each other to get their idea chosen. In April, Quinn found out his had won. When I won, it the whole thing just like <laughs> my whole world flipped upside down. And since April, he has been working on this video with Nikki's guidance while also meeting the event organizers' demands. The level of detail, the level of craft, and the amount of uh, client overhead that we got through this project was unlike anything I've ever done before, and it was extremely professional. And when the video plays on the new Jumbotron for the tens of thousands in attendance at Hayward Field, Quinn hopes his gets the crowd going. I hope it'll be good. I hope people enjoy it, obviously. I think it's pretty uh, crowd pleasing and gets people hyped up for the event, which is the intended goal. Devin Haskins, KGW News.